The Marblehead Coast Guard Station sits on the shores of Lake Erie. This station is responsible for boater safety near areas like Cedar Point, Kelly's Island, and Putin Bay. Where did that call come in from? They said they were off Catawba? On this day, the team responded to a call from the Ottawa County Sheriff's Department asking them to check on kayakers. The crew was ready for anything. I'm about 100 yards off my starboard side. You gotta be mentally prepared, motivated to possibly pull someone out of the water, pull the kayak that's full of water onto the boat, prepare to save a life. But as the Coast Guard pulled up alongside the kayakers, they found the boaters prepared for the trip. They're just crossing over from Catawba uh, over to the islands. They said they're experienced boaters. Uh, they're wearing their life jackets. They have their safety equipment. So they're going to be good to go on their way. They're out here enjoying the lake. More power to them. The Coast Guard on the Great Lakes has a large responsibility because of the variable environment. Just from the summer having you know, the boating traffic and then switching over to winter where the lake potentially could freeze over and then performing ice rescues. In the past year, the Marblehead Station has been out on 101 search and rescue missions. The station has taken part in 931 law enforcement cases from drunk boating to illegal drugs and they patrol the border with Canada. Anytime there's a border nearby, you always have the potential for having illegal activity, uh, whether it's human trafficking or drug smuggling here. Uh, we take a really proactive stance. General safety checks are a big part of preventing accidents. The Coast Guard checks that boats have proper safety gear like life jackets, flares, and fire extinguishers. No matter the situation, the Marblehead Station is ready. It doesn't matter if it's 3 in the morning, it doesn't matter if it's 2 in the afternoon, Monday, Wednesday, or you know Saturday, Sunday, we're going to be here, we're going to come get you. For more stories on the U.S. Coast Guard, head to greatlakesnow.org.